With some unfortunate events, we are back with the Pokemon Fire Pokemon Red. I will make you What's going on guys? Sorry for the unexpectedness that may have happened. Um, we'll just have to continue from here. Uh, we beat a Snorlax, uh, so basically freaking, you know, things happen, so unfortunately we are starting from here and going to our 30 minutes, so what you may have missed if I decide not to upload it from that, we are, I think we might be actually almost done with this? I'm not actually quite sure, I saw Finn right there, maybe that's the, um, probably the uh, exit of the um, winning the, the bike race, that's probably what that is, that means right there. But anyways, we beat Lieutenant Sarge, we talk to some police to help us out so we can free the Pokemon. Um, we did that, we got our bike, re re uh, returned the Pokemon that were trapped, uh, SSN left, we are now on a bike race, so that is what we're doing. We beat, we finished beating up a Snorlax that was in our way. We didn't actually get a chance to catch it, which is all right. So let's go ahead and continue from there. All right, so this is the end of the race. The winner is Raymond. Uh, at least I had fun. Yep, we always have fun with bike races because bike races are the best. So I thought we were almost done with the chapter, but I guess this is just the end of the bike race. So nonetheless, we will go ahead and continue on. What's going on? See, that was tiring. I should take a break. Uh, it's been weeks since I left Viridian Forest. I wonder how far ahead Hank is. A few days ago. Ha ha ha, ghosts. I'll prove them wrong. Tisk, Charmeleon, come out now. Uh, come out, coward. Ch uh, Charmeleon? What is it? Uh, what was that? Ah! Huh? Oop, something Arceus, maybe. I don't know. Something interesting there. Hi, I'm learning to be an Officer Jenny. Okay. Okay. Let's see, you're going to Lavender Town? Erg. Good luck, the people there are evil. Hmm. Quite interesting. Let's see what this person up here has to say. Have you ever heard, have you ever been to the Orange Archipelago? It's so tropical there. Never been to the Orange Tropic, uh, Tropic, Tropipelago? Blah, whatever, anyways. Uh, I'm not a good trainer, so I'm just going to give you this weird egg. Uh, take that, or that, blah, whatever. Can't English today, I'm sorry. That makes sense. I got a mysterious egg. Uh, it's time for me to find a wife. Alrighty, let's see what is this egg that we have. Uh, occasionally moves, it should hatch soon. Well, that's good. Should be able to hatch that soon. So hopefully we should be able to heal up once we get into Lavender Town. So that is what we are going to do as we get through right here. Route 12. Hey, it's green. I remember seeing green from the green chapter. Uh, Lavender Town. I'm not going near that place without a oscilloscope. I remember we were looking for that oscilloscope. I remember that. Uh, but I do believe that this is a little bit different from what we did with the green chapter. So this is going to be a little bit different from what we originally had. Just the uh, the bridge area is going to be different, but that's all right. So we have a fisherman up here, which is fine. We are going to go ahead. And he's got a Psyduck. We've got our trusty Bulbasaur. We're going to go for our Razor Leaf. Take out the Psyduck and the rest of his Pokemon. <laughs> also, we got some levels on our uh, Kangas Koo. So that's pretty good. We got the Clamp. That's not really going to do much. Got our Razor Leaf. Should be able to take out the Shelter with another hit. Alright, clamp, no, that's no problem. Gonna go for the leer, it's not gonna really do a whole lot. But if you guys haven't checked out the past episodes, make sure to do so, because they are pretty cool. 
And if you haven't checked out the links in the description below, make sure to check out the links in the description below. Subscribe if you are new, and if you have not subscribed, why have you not subscribed? Highly recommend you guys subscribe and turn on the bell for notifications so you know when I upload more content to the channel. Also, highly recommend you check out the Vidly channel as that will be hyped pretty soon once we get more uh, videos up on that channel. Let's say, remember me? I'm, it's Daisy. I'm glad to, I'm glad you came. Lavender Town is pretty scary. Anyways, my grandpa wants me to give you this. Hey, we got an Ultra Ball. That's good. See you later. Alright. So let's go ahead and get into Lavender Town. It's raining. Uh, yeah, we've got to find some place... Uh, someplace out of this rain. Uh, excuse me, Humph? Okay. Geez, is this Lavender Town or Leave Them Their Town? I need to find some place to stay. So, we are going to find our Pokemon Center right here. I'm gonna go ahead and heal up, see what these two dudes have to say. <clears throat> Let's see, I got nothing to share with you. Uh, I can't s uh, can't you see we're just old men who like to be left alone? Alright, totally fine. We'll leave them alone with said business. So there's stuff happening up here which is quite interesting. I don't think this was a this uh, up here wasn't actually available in the green chapter, so that's quite interesting. We do have the tower. Do you wanna go into any of these places, I guess? Uh, my son is beginning to gain weight. He really needs to start exercising. Uh, yum, I love eating mushrooms. Oh, hey, I'm Pinky. I am I am the Pokemon move maniac. I know every single move that Pokemon learn growing up. Bring me two tiny mushrooms or one big mushroom. If you do that for me, I'll teach a move to one Pokemon. Uh, if your Pokemon need to, need to learn a move, I need a mushroom or two. So that's a good thing to know. If we have any mushrooms to bring it to that dude right there. Let's see what this dude. Uh, can I stay here until the rain stops? Mr. Fuji, hey I remember Mr. Fuji from the green chapter. Hint hint. Sure, of course, come in, thanks. Uh, a few hours later. Thank you, you know I was surprised that you allowed me to stay. Everyone in the town is so rude. Uh, people here have become slaves to their own suspicious. Uh, come with me. Hmm, mind if I ask you what are you doing? Uh, ho ho, just paying my respect, just paying my respect. Uh, here lies Dodudo, rest in peace. Rip in the comments below. Uh, he lived to a ripe, let's see, yeah, he lived to a, yeah, that's right, duh. Uh, I lived to a ripe old man, my beloved Dodudo, but his time came at last. I also want to pay my respect. Thank you. Are you also a Pokemon lover? Yes, sir. Uh, so, who are you, sir? Ah, oh, my name is Mr. Fuji. For many years, this town has been said to be the gathering place for the souls of Pokemon. To honor those souls and give them a place to rest, the people here erected the Lavender Tower. You mean that building is a Pokemon cemetery? Indeed. If that's the cemetery, why didn't you build your memorial in there? Because no one now dares to venture near that tower due to the recent sighting of ghosts. Ha <laughs> ha ghosts, he says. Pokemon ghosts. You saw the townspeople fear with your own eyes. They have become so terrified of the ghosts that they have forgotten how to trust one another. Uh, they won't even make eye contact with strangers. It's your choice whether you believe it or not. I just wish I could let my Dodudo rest in a nicer place instead of the weed-infested alley. Uh, you must have you must have cared for it. Uh, here's a photo of my Dodudo. Mm, that's Hank in the photo. Uh, you know that lad. I'm on a quest right now to fill up his this Pokedex with information on every Pokemon there is. My rival is Hank. Uh, where is he now? Ah, he passed through this town just before I lost my Dodudo, just like you. When I told him about the ghost, he laughed it off. He then ran off to uh, Lavender Tower, thinking he'd prove us all to be fools. Uh, that was two weeks ago. He hasn't come back. 
so Hank is missing, the guy's personality could really use some improvement, but as a trainer, he's the real deal. He doesn't go down easy. So what could you put out, or what could put out of action for two whole weeks? Could it possibly be? Could that tower really be haunted by ghosts? I'm going to get to the bottom of this. Alright, so that is what we're doing. We are going to check out this said lavender tower. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking about this tombstone should be my dad. What? No, I didn't. Uh, you will pay. You will pay. I actually remember this person from the green chapter as well. The same person was there. So, with that, let's go into lavender tower. The spooky, spooky scary place. Also, happy Valentine's Day to anyone that is having a great Valentine's out there. Happy Valentine's. Uh, this place doesn't look so big from the outside. Hey, what's with this fog? Huh? Is that a Pokemon? Wow. Well, it's a Psyduck, that's for sure. Nope. It's a ghost. Uh, darn, the ghost can't be ID'd. Go Bulbasaur. Alright, let's go for a Razor Leaf. Get out, get out! Hmm. Uh, Bulbasaur is too scared to move. Um, can we not battle it? Should we just run then? We got away safely. Okay. Uh, it just disappeared. So I guess we will continue. Huh? The fog. Uh, I thought I heard something. Mm, another ghost. Just another ghost. A corpse sent out ghastly. Ooh. So we do actually have something to fight this time. Gonna go for Shadow Sneak. Alright. We got our Razor Leaf. That is what we'll do. Our trusty Razor Leaf. Let's go for... It's gonna go for Curse. So that might be bad. Okay, so evaded the attack from there. Yeah, that's gonna be bad. At least we can possibly use... Nightshade, hopefully we can live this, thank you. We're gonna go for the Razor Leaf, take out the Gas Leaf, just like that. Level 19. And learned Double Hit, nice. And we defeated the corpse. Uh, it's just a corpse, what's making it move? Something must be controlling this thing. Uh, the fog is clearing up. Arr. Uh, it's gone, I... It was moving while it was under the fog. This means that the purple haze is what controlling them. The fog is back. Okay, there must be a way to get rid of it. Well, we are actually going to go back so we can heal up, that's for sure. Because we need a full health of Pokemon. Full health team. So that's what we're doing. It's pretty cool how we have that uh, that dude with the Abra that he can teleport us to anywhere we need to go. So it's pretty much we pretty much it's like we don't even need the HM fly, which I don't even know if we actually get within this chapter. But it's pretty cool how we have them, so that's that's really nice. Um, so what we will do is we will go into Lavender Town, get up to the second floor, figure out what's going on. We've got these corpses here. Let's see if we can't get around them. I don't think, actually we can get around them. We'll go this way, but we will have to battle this one, I guess? Unless we were not supposed to, I don't know. I think we were supposed to talk to the uh, the other one, but that's all right. This one has a slowpoke, which is fine. We can easily take out this slowpoke here with a razor leaf. All right, razor leaf missed. We got a water gun, which is all right. Go for the razor leaf, should take it out with one hit. Nope. Okay, I'm gonna go for the headbutt, which is fine. And we missed. Great, thanks. Thank you, Slowpoke. Thank you very much. We have our Vine Whip, which should be able to take it out. Gonna go for a water gun. And we can take it out with our razor leaf now. Just like so. There we go. Alrighty. Rawr. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and go around, talk to this dude right here. The corpse isn't moving at all. 
Uh, do we have to battle this one? Yep, we're gonna have to battle this one, unfortunately. That is fine. It's got a Vulpix. And we've got a water type just for that. Polyrath. Alright, that failed move. Move failed. Faint attack, which is fine. Should be able to live it perfectly fine. We'll go for the Ice Beam. I should be able to take it out. Nope, Ice Beam, it didn't work, but we got the Freeze. So that is pretty good. Let's go for our Water Gun. Should be able to take it out, since it's now frozen. Go for... Okay, so Imprision failed, which is fine. Go for the Water Gun, easily take out Vulpix, just like so. Alright, it's got a main key, so what we'll do is we'll switch out back to Vulpsaur. Should be able to take it out with some Razor Leaves. Minky, go for the Razor Leaf. Gonna go for that Screech. And we got our Razor Leaf. Yeah, how are you guys doing today? Hope you guys are doing alright. I am doing fine. Had to do some things, which is fine. <clears throat> yeah, what is your guys' favorite Pokemon game or favorite chapter? That is lay a question of today. Leave a comment down below. As always, comments are welcome. And if you haven't joined Lay Discord, you guys can do so by messaging me through YouTube. And you guys can join, or you can go to the About page, where the link to the Discord is there. The Jam Sky official link. You guys can go ahead and click that on the About page. But we do have a new system with our Discord server, so we've got a special room that you guys will arrive in, and with our admins and whatnot, we will figure out if you guys are good to join the rest of what's going on. Uh, this gravestone is gl isn't er, yeah, it's glowing. This might be where the fogs are coming from. Should I touch it? Sure, why not? Okay, here it goes. Alright, so we got that. Now we can go ahead and continue up to the next floor and see what else is going on with this spooky scary place. And apparently we can run into ghosts. Can't, can't ID them, which is fine. So we'll just run away as we probably would. TM30 Shadow Ball. Awesome. And we get into a battle with a ghost. I think these are actually Dusclops. Or not Dusclops, um... Whatever they are, I can't remember. The uh, the sprite on the overworld looks like... Uh, I can't remember, but I, I believe you know what I'm talking about. Anyways, we will go on and continue with this battle here. Should be able to take it out with one more Razor Leaf, just like so. Yeah, hopefully I can uh, upload two videos is what I wanted to do because... To make up for yesterday, as I didn't get a chance to upload yesterday... We want to learn a double edge. Um, 100 accuracy, 120 power. Uh, it also hurts the user, so I don't think I want it. Uh, stop learning double edge. Yes, I don't think I want that. <clears throat> and hey, Bulbasaur is now evolving. Which it would have evolved back at level 16, but it is now evolving nonetheless. We have a Evolution, which is amazing. So now we have Ivysaur. Alright, so now we should be able to continue nonetheless. Once we battle this a corpse here, it's gonna send out two Pokemon, it's got a coughing, which is fine. Also, I have a different uh, filter on uh, this emulator, so I'm not sure if you guys can uh, tell the difference. Okay, self-destruct. Well then. Not necessarily what I was planning, but okay. King's Q is now level 20. Got another Ghastly. Or actually, the first one was Coffee, now it's Ghastly. Okay. So there's a difference. Yes, I know. Alrighty. And we're going to hurt ourselves in confusion. Perfect. Thank you. Just what I wanted. Perfect. Okay, let's go for Pikachu. Hopefully Pikachu can help us out here. Let's go for the Thunderbolt. 
awesome. One hit, one kill. Sweet. And we defeated Corpse. <clears throat> and what we'll do is we will go back down to the bottom so we can go back and heal up. We are at lay 20 minutes, which is all right, so we'll have 10 minutes. <clears throat> go ahead and heal up one second. Turn on, do not disturb on my phone down here while it's a charging. Alright, sorry about that. Okay, now we can go ahead and continue on to Lavender Tower. Go right back up. Lavender Tower. Got the spooky, spooky, scary music. Which is alright back into the purple haze we'll go ahead and get through go ahead and touch this thing right here which we ran into another ghost and that was actually a cubone so we can go ahead and run from that for now touch the gold gravestone right here that should get rid of the haze just like that and now we can go ahead and continue and unfortunately we still run into so that was actually a ghastly. Even though we can't identify who they are, we can still hear the cries, so that is alright. Go ahead and grab this item here, we got a potion, we got some golden graves around here, so we'll figure out which one it is. And that one's also ghastly. <clears throat> got some golden graves. Go ahead and figure out, okay, that one is not it, but that one is a ghastly. So we will go ahead and run from that one for now. Go ahead and grab this twisted spoon. Hmm. Okay, so I think this one's just going to continue with ghastlies. I think we might have to actually battle it. I'm not quite sure, but let's run away and see. It was a fake, yeah, okay. So what we'll do is we will touch this one right here, yep, get rid of all the purple haze, make sure there's nothing else, we are good. Go up to the next level and see what is going on. This floor should have a lot of gravestones. Oh, something's going on. That was a fire, could that mean pink? Let's see what's going on here. Uh, you're okay, I never thought I'd be so glad to say that. Now let's back. What? Uh, what's the deal with you, Hank? What happened to you, Hank? Talk to me, dude. His eyes. He he is being controlled by this fog too. I need to stop him. So that is what we'll do. We'll go ahead and stop him. He's got a scyther, level 27. So let's go ahead and leech see. False swipe. Alright, no biggie. <clears throat> go for our leech seed. Gonna go for the agility, which is fine. Got our razor leaf, which is not gonna do too much, which is alright, I guess. Uh, let's go ahead and switch out. Let's go into Pikachu. I think Pikachu should be able to help us out here. It's got a potion, but we still have the leech seed going, which is good, which is pretty good. Go for a thunderbolt. Got a wing attack going there. Thunderbolt should be able to take it out. Yep, and then we got the leech seed there, so that takes it out just like that. And we have our speed boost, so that's good. Okay, and char million. Let's go ahead and switch into Polyrath. Should be able to beat this char million with our Polyrath. It's got level 30. We're level 22. Should have no problem. Maybe, not quite sure. It's gonna go for the smoke screen. We can try for the ice beam, but I don't think that's gonna work. It's gonna go for the fire fang. Hopefully, yep, we survived that pretty well. Going for the water gun. Should be able to take it out with. He used a re 
What? Did he revive his Scyther? Did he really just revive his Scyther? Level 21. Okay, never mind. He used a revive for no reason. What the heck was that? That had to have been a glitch. That was weird. He used a revive, and it did nothing. That's questionable. Interesting. Anyways, uh, we can't keep fighting each other like this. I gotta find out the person behind this. Now let's see. There's only one Pokemon that I know that could take over bodies like this. Uh, one gas Pokemon with power of a, a Psychonelysis Gasly. Blah. Whatever that is. <clears throat> and we are taking on a Ghastly now, level 30. So we should be able to use some Razor Leaves to take out this Ghastly at level 30. Missed it, which is fine. Let's go for our Leech Seed tactic, hopefully. Yep, there we go. Put on the Leech Seed. That should help us out here. Go for a, a Razor Leaf. Go for Payback, we can live that. Go for the Razor Leaf, that should help us out. Yeah, as long as we have the Leech Seed, that's going to help us out a lot. <clears throat> Get one for Razor Leaf. Should be able to live this, hopefully. <clears throat> Going for a Confuse Ray. That is alright. Okay. That's fine. We still have our Leech Seed, so that's going to heal us up. Should be able to do one more Razor Leaf. Shadow Ball is going to knock us out, which is fine. But it's almost dead anyways, so we can switch into we'll switch into Pikachu for now. Going for the Leech Seed, which is fine. It's almost dead. We can go for a, a Thunderbolt here. Never mind, it's gonna confuse us. And her her. Alright, her herself in confusion, which is fine, but nonetheless, it's dead. Just like that. And we got a speed boost. Alright, so we beat the Ghastly that was inside of Hank. Uh, Yoho, snap out of it. Erg, it's just you. Ah, back to your old obnoxious self, I see. Indeed, you have my gratitude for today. Hank, we gotta get out of this tower. Something's really wrong here. Hey, that's not the way out. I said we gotta get out of here. I'll show that buffoon. Buffoon? Uh, he thinks he can cast a spell on me, does he? Uh, I won't ask you to tag along, you'll just slow me down, so go home. I'll take back the old obnoxious self flying, you're, uh, you're worse. Okay then, so what we'll do is we will save it here. Figure out what is going on, I think what we'll do is we will get out of here so we can heal up, because I mean, unless we have items, we should have uh, some items. Do, do, do. We don't have any revives. Actually, we have some revives, never mind. So we'll use a revive and figure out what's going on. We got 13 potions, so we'll use some potions to heal up. Okay, so we should be good. So let's figure out what's going on up here. Uh, these purple ooze on the ground are high toxic acid. Okay, so we will have to go around these. There is a Sir Viper. Or not Sir Viper, it's a uh, Arbok. It's an Arbok. <clears throat> uh, that must be the Pokemon that is shooting out the Venom. Uh, the Arbok's move is way too coordinate. Someone must be controlling it. Show yourself, whoever you are. Ha ha ha. Uh, you, you the one from Mount Moon. Ah, yes, the uh, squirt who spoiled my careful plan. Let me introduce myself. I am one of Team Rocket's elite trade, Ninja Koja. Uh, as if Team Rocket had an elite in anything. Uh, this town was perfect for us. You see, the townsfolk blame every, uh, every suspicious or irregulatory on ghosts. This allowed us, Team Rocket, to build a secret base up here. Er, this is payback for the humiliation back in Mount Moon, kid. So we are going to have to end up fighting him. He's got one Pokemon, which is Arbok, level 36. 
Let's see if we can put on our Leech C, because that's going to help out a bunch. It's going for the stockpile, which is fine. And that missed. Let's try it again. Spit up. There we go. Put on our Leech C. That's going to help out a lot. Yeah, I think the Leech C tactic is definitely something that's helpful. Let's go for our Razor Leaf. It's not going to do a whole lot, which is fine, but we've got that going for us. Uh, I think what we should, we can. Let's switch to Polyrath and see what we can do with Polyrath here. That's going to heal us up, which is good. Let's try for Ice Beam, Acid Spray. We can live that definitely. We're at our. 30 minutes, but once we finish off this battle, we'll end this acid spray, which is fine. We can live that. Go for our ice beam. Got the, uh, the leech seed still going, so that's good. Go for one more. Hopefully, we can live this acid spray. Nope. That is fine. We'll switch into a Pikachu here. got that going and Arbok is down. Alrighty. I need to retreat. Ah, how did you like that? Um, the battle isn't over yet. Come on out, Tremillion. Slash. What? No way. Humph. Now it's your turn. Now what's your move? Uh, this Hank is good. Not that I'll ever tell him that in person. Grr. I've, I'll never forget this little worse. Ninja Arc Smokescreen. Uh, where are you going now? Never mind. Oh well. Uh, better find Mr. Fuji and tell him everything is okay. Alright, so now that we did that, battle's over. Finish up, save here. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure to smash that like button. Subscribe if you have not. I'll see you guys in the next one. And as always, stay cool. Get to the outro. Once everything decides to load, give me a few seconds here. I'll see you guys next time.